In this lesson, we are going to learn about the usefulness and limitations of the balance sheet. Why is the balance sheet so useful to users? Can you think of any reasons why you might be interested in the balance sheet of a company as an investor? The balance sheet of a company enables the users to calculate the rates of return and evaluate the capital structure of the company. In order to assess the risk of the company and the future cash flows, users might use the balance sheet to assess the company's liquidity, solvency, and financial flexibility. The liquidity tells us how fast an asset can be realized or converted into cash, or how fast a liability has to be paid. The solvency actually tells us whether the company is able to pay its debts. High level of debt means low solvency and higher risk. Both liquidity and solvency affect the financial flexibility of a company. The financial flexibility tells us about the ability of the company to take actions to explore opportunities or satisfy needs. Imagine a company that is financially inflexible, it has high amounts of debt. That company cannot expand and take advantage of the opportunities presented or cannot even pay its debt. On the other hand, a, a company that is financially flexible can actually recover from any setback and also, which is more important, take advantage of profitable investment opportunities. The balance sheet also has some limitations. Let's take a look at some of them. Most of the items on the balance sheet are reported at cost. This might not present the situation as it is in the moment. Imagine if a company bought a building in Manhattan 100 years ago for $10,000. Even though it would be worth millions now, it still says $10,000 on the balance sheet. For many of the amounts presented on the balance sheet, accountants use estimate and judgments. This might not be very accurate. Some items are not presented at all on the balance sheet. Imagine an airline company that hires only very experienced pilots. They are the best assets of the company. However, we cannot measure their worth. The balance sheet is the same as the accounting equation. Basically, assets equal liabilities plus stockholders' equity. We will take a closer look at these in the following lessons.